What's up, you guys? My name is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Taurus, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button and be notified for future readings. This is the, this is the gist in 96. So, energy pulling for the next four hours, approximately. Today is 8 19 and 2022. So, it'll be 8 19 today till 8 22 of 2022. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. If everyone has free will, only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Um, it's a general energy pulling. So it's, it's supposed to be the next 40, um, 72 hours. I'm sorry, 96 hours. Four days, 96 hours. But everybody's on different time and life paths. So for some of you guys, it could start resonating now for some after the four days. Um, there's seven point some something billion people in the world, so you really have to um, plug, you know, plug the message or messages into your own particular life situation. How it resonates this is for a sign of course, so this could resonate if you have course in any aspects of your charts. If you think anyone else would like my channel, you guys, please feel free to share it very publicly on social media and word of mouth. Very much appreciate it. Okay, Taurus. So I received a couple channel messages for your just in '96. The first one I heard a Taurus. Um, wanted to mix business with pleasure but it's about to backfire in a huge way that was the first one and um oh i forgot the second one hold on give me a second i forgot the second one um i forgot the second one so um if I remember it, I'll let you know. Um, but yeah, so, well, but the one that I did remember was one of you guys heard you wanted to mix business with pleasure. So you wanted to mix business with pleasure, but it's about to backfire in a huge way. So that could be the power for some of you guys. Um, I feel for some, you um, want to date a coworker or you want to date someone that you're doing business with or they're, or um, they're doing business with you or something like that, but it's about to backfire in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, how that resonates? I feel that could be a 3D workspace situation or like a business, um, you getting services from them or they getting services from you or something like that. How that resonates and applies, okay? All right, so we have Tower Upright, Knight of Wands Upright, uh, Knight of Swords Reverse, the Harpin Upright. A contract that has already been signed in the universe, it is about to blow out of hell. Blow out of hell. It's not going to work out the way the business thought it was going to. Okay, so here's your contract. Huge tower. A contract's about to blow out of hell, blow out of hell. It's not going to work out the way the business thinks it's going to. Um, I think you work for this business, Taurus, and that's why I'm pulling this in, or you know somebody that works for this business. How that resonates and applies. Um, somehow, a contract that it sounds like is it's a contract. I think it might have already been signed, possibly, or not. I feel in line of situations it has, but... Um, now, you know, some some contracts have grace periods to pull out. Some they don't. Um, it really all depends if it's a small item, large item, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But whatever this is, it is a, it's a contract. And I feel it's already been signed. Um, but in some of these situations, I feel it already has because it's about to blow all to hell. Um, if you haven't signed the contract, there's, you know, you didn't sign your signature there. You see what I'm saying? Um, now, you know, there are things out there called fraudulent signatures. So this, if it has been signed, I don't think this is a fraudulent signature. You see what I'm saying? But how that resonates, I heard it's about to blow all to hell. The business thought it was going to go one way, but it's not. It's going to go the other. Um, that could be, so I think for some, you could work for this business or you can know somebody that um, is dealing with this situation, how that resonates. Tower. I heard it's about to blow all to hell. Like, 
This is not literal explosion, but the contract blowing all to hell. Something has happened with this contract or something shady or shysty or not ethical or something has happened. Knight of Wands upright. Um, backing out, very significant. Everybody needs to move on and they're about to through many series of chain events. Backing out has become very significant and everybody needs to move on. And I heard everybody will through many series of chain events. So, um, backing out has become significant. So, somebody, it sounds like somebody's already signed this contract. Um, and I feel it's not fraudulent signature. I feel it is a true person, true signature, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But somebody in this situation wants to back out. It could be the business or it could be the other party or parties. But somebody wants to back out, and I heard they both will, business and the other party or parties for many series of chain events. So desire, drive, and motivation to back out of this because of some kind of lies in the past um, with the Knight of Swords reversed. I feel it could be an um, immature energy that has lied over a person, people, place, or situation, or the contract. It's, it's, they're coming in as a knight, or um, that's what I feel. I think it's an immature person or a younger person, 25 or below. Because we're pulling up two night cards, night of wands, too. Desire, drive, and motivation to back out now. Not desire, drive, and motivation in the past to back out, but it's because this contract blown all to hell in some shape, form, or fashion. But I feel younger energies lied about person, people, place, or situation, or immature energies, because they're both coming in as nights. So you plug it in, how it resonates, and this is that contract. It's with the business. So um, whatever this is and how this applies in your life course. I feel for some of you could work with this business. For some of you could assign the contract with your legally binding signature, not a fraudulent signature. Um, for some, you could know somebody in this situation. You plug it in how it resonates, Taurus, but this is your contract all day long. Um, this is a marriage or business contract. Um, and it's your energy, Taurus. Torn energy with scorp scorpionic energy. So you plug it in how it resonates. I heard through many series of chain events, both parties are going to be able to back out. Um, they're going to back out and move on. Um, so it sounds like somebody wanted to keep somebody entrapped and stuck in this contract. Um, regardless, but um, something, it sounds like universal force, uh, force energy is about to happen to where they're both going to be able to move on. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates. I feel guided to get a keeper. Uh, this is kind of a long, just a 96, but we'll do it real quick. And somehow, um, someone wanting to mix business with pleasure um, is about to, uh, um, is significant in here too. So that could be you wanting to mix business with pleasure or someone else. Poverty, number 37, could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 37, poverty. A Taurus knows a feminine energy has been left in poverty strategically. High vibrational Taurus, they're about to make mini series of chain events, create mini series of chain events to expose this information. And for another Taurus, you're about to lose a lot of money on many business deals. They're about not to go through. Many people are about to energy shift away from a, from a particular company. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So for one of you Tauruses, you're high vibrationally to treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrities, and values. I heard you um heard you know a fem energy has strategically been left out uh, in the cold financially poverty. They somebody has strategically left them in poverty. Um, so they you know they didn't give them money or etc cetera, etc cetera, etc cetera, they should have been given it sounds like um for one of you guys and you treat people honestly trust respect morals ethics integrity and value if that resonates for you number one does but i heard you are gonna um deliver the information to somebody soon about this so i think you care about this situation and you're about to deliver it to maybe um get her some help or or um or get the money returned if it can be returned um Situation two, you um, 
you um you work for a company, a business, and it sounds like the business is about to start going down. People are going to start energy shifting away from the business. I heard bad business practices, so something to do with the ethical ethical side of this business. Um, and it sounds like several people are about to do this. Many people do not want anything to do with this business. Many people do not want anything to do with this business. So many people are about to energy shift away from this business. Um, they do not want anything to do with this business. For one, it's an illegal business. For one, it is a legal business. For one, it's an illegal business. For one, it's a legal business. So you plug it in how it resonates, Taurus. All right, we can add this. Love you guys. Almost day.